I am getting old. Fifteen years ago when I started here, I didn't need these glasses. Now I have to put them on. <laughs> he looks smarter already. Thank you. Young man that I'm about to give the Brother Michael Reynolds Award to is a special person to me, just like all the seniors. Uh, this young man showed up four years ago, not a very big kid, uh, not very strong, not very tall, but there was something about him I love. I really love this kid. From the first day he came into full baseball, I put him on the pitcher's mound down in the bullpen at Cardians Field, and I'll never forget this day. And I looked at him and I said to him, uh, as he was doing a bullpen, and I'm watching his, his mechanics, I said, hey, uh, Matt Sinrazzo, I said, do you have any family members in Jersey, come from Jersey, New York, that are connected to the mob? And he looked at me and said, don't play me and I'll show you. <laughs> He said to me, my name is Matarazzo. I, and one of the senior pitchers looked at him and said, Coach Sorello's going to call you anything he wants. <laughs> so I said, go back to pitching Matarazzo. <laughs> as a baseball player, he pitched a little bit as a freshman, but his sophomore year, along with the other guys, he had to step up and he had to do two things. He had to pitch and he had to play second base. And he's been doing that for the past three years. It's a very difficult task in college because it puts a lot of wear and tear on an individual to be able to pitch seven innings and then go out and play second base and bat and do all those things. But him and his other seniors, Patty Quinn, they get in the uh, weight room and they worked out. They did the things necessary to be two-way play, uh, two players. Last year, Charlie hit 323 for us. And in one of the memorable moments, uh, Curry College beat us last year, 27 to three and 14 to three in a regular season. And we went up there to play them. They were the best team in the, in the conference. And Charlie hit a grand slam. Uh, we won that game 12 to 10. They were knocked out. And Charlie led us to the conference championship game where he pitched and kept us in the game uh, for seven innings. He did a tremendous job. This year, he has a 6-0 record, along with playing second base. And, and I tried to rest him a little bit. He used to get mad at me and look at me when I didn't play him. But it was he knew and I knew it was for the betterment of the team. I am so glad you came here, Charlie. It's been a great four years. I told you it was going to go by fast. Next year, Charlie. Charles, should I call you Dr. Charles? Charles has been accepted to the University of Temple in dentist school and he's going to become a doctor. I'd like to present, present this award to Charlie Matarazzo. championship and from there just uh, we can live with the bonds we made through all our teams. <laughs> Thanks, Pat. <laughs> um, thank you. 